22. The Dreamers of the Day. It's over, Drake. Tell me more. What? How did that not kill him? Are you fucking insane? Uh -oh. Cool, I guess I'm just gonna fucking die then. Okay, I guess there's someone fucking camping up top there. That's good to know. I can't, like... How am I supposed to get to him without walking out into his line of fire? Sure, I guess it works. At least these guys aren't the fucking bullet sponge type. How do we make the ending of our game more tense? I don't know, let's make enemies that can just take fucking a million more hits than everyone else. Seems pretty good. Oh, crap. Wow, great fucking aiming. Okay, who did that? Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you, kid. Oh, thank God. <sighs> you all right? Man, I had a hell of a time. What's the matter with you? How do I know you're real? Ow! That real enough for you? <sighs> Don't ever point a gun at me again. <laughs> Knew it. Knew he wasn't dead. I saw them shoot you. Right after the eclipse. What? What eclipse? Look, kid, you went nuts right after you drank from that fountain. It's the water. That's huh. what destroyed the city. Not the wrath of God. The whole water supply is tainted with some sort of hallucinogenic agent. Must have drove everyone mad. That's cool. That's what Marlowe and Talbot are after. <sighs> oh, man, yeah. Remember, Cutter said... They controlled their enemies through fear. <laughs> this would do it. In spades. But, wait, it doesn't make any sense. How do they think they're getting the water out of here? No, no, it's not the water. It's what's in the water. Come again? I, listen, just bear with me for a sec. Salim told me that Aram was cursed 
when Solomon imprisoned the evil spirits of the Jinn inside a vessel of brass, and then cast it into the depths of the city. A genie in a bottle. I know, it sounds pretty crazy. So you reckon that's why Elizabeth and Dee sent Francis Drake out here in the first place? Yeah. It wasn't treasure they were after. It was power. Only once Drake realized what he'd been sent for, he abandoned the mission. He lied to the Queen, told her he didn't find anything, and then hid all traces of his voyage. Rewrote history. Well, who are we to argue with Sir Francis? When you say we head down there and end this thing? Once and for oh all. Oh boy, a boss fight? Please? I love a boss fight. Look at this place. The whole city's resting on this cavern. Doesn't look very safe, does it? That's an understatement. We no, not particularly. Is it to do yeah. with this twisty yeah, lever? This That's a cool twist. That is the water. Here. You ready for this? Let's do it. Oh, good. Don't tell me. More combat sections. Just one after the other, after the other, after the other. Amazing. This is how they move the water to the surface. God. Look at the ceiling here. I'm surprised the whole place hasn't come crashing down yet. I don't know how the hell it's still standing. It's very pretty. Give it that. Yoink. Get out of my way, knob jockey. We gotta get across there. Help me with this door. <laughs> Once again, impossible to open without two people. Thankfully, we have two people every time. Why? Sorry? Are there people down there? Hunt them down. Where are they coming from? I hear them. Are they down there? Shit, get down, because there's nobody here. Guess I'm dropping down? Okay, then there are people here, sure. Oh, that killed him. Okay. Sounds good to me, man. Honestly, at this point, I'm just grateful that I'm not fighting the fucking never-ending health people. The fire demon dudes. That's what I'm glad about right now. Because that was possibly the least fun I've ever had in my entire life. Like, as soon as one hits you, you're fucked. Because you don't have time to wait for your health regen to, to fucking pop out of cover and get another.
get bent. Hey Sally, look at this, it's another magical two-person door. They're definitely going into the water. Hey. <laughs> Sweet. What is that, an underwater gun? Well, that's gonna be important later. Sully, help me with this. We gotta get through here. Let me guess. More fighting. Please. I love fighting. No? Oh my god. We've actually managed to walk five steps without a new fucking fight? This is amazing. Lift it gently. What's the reckoning? This whole city above us ends up caving in on this place. You gotta be kidding me. We gotta take that thing out. Any ideas? Well, I sure as hell got us And out burying it forever. Let's, uh, let's split up. Try to flank them. Yeah. Let's split Better up and look for clues. She seriously hasn't seen us do that? It, are, you, are you sure? Sully. Sully! Oh, fuck. Well, now you're both fucked. You're literally submerged in this shit. Banter. Get to fuck, lady. Jesus Christ, what is this? Fucking micro missiles? Oh yeah, I'm totally gonna I'm totally gonna record that. This whole fucking cavern is gonna get buried by the city above. Please tell me you didn't swallow any of that water. I don't think so. It would have got up your nose or in your ears though. Why we can't have nice things. <laughs> we gotta move. Oh, oh hi. In full cover. Nothing I could do to prevent it. Love it. Where's the one that... I don't know who fired the thing. Is there someone up top? You. Fuck yourself. Well, oh shit. Hello, Snipes McGee. That's not what I wanted.
straight into the elevator. Is that the plan? Sully, this way. We gotta get out of here. Come on, I need your help. Crap. Oh my oh, life. Okay, that went well. The hell happened there? What the fuck is going on with my aim? Up the ladder, I guess. Over here, Sully. Up this way. How are we gonna get out of here? We're going to climb. Sully, we're gonna have to ride these up, alright? fashioned way it is then. This exit bit's been pretty cool. Not swarms of enemies. You, Drake. Me! Oh, you're going down, lady. Dickhead. Bye, Talbot. Run. Up here. Hurry it up. Sully, we gotta get out of here. The whole place is coming down. Hurry just keep up. running, just keep running, just keep running, running, running. What do we do? We run. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did we do this? Oh my, f this is cool. This is sick. I really hope I do it in, on my first try. Okay. Neat, very neat. Oh my God, everything's crumbling. This is amazing. Oh, I love this. Big fan. Oh! Oh my god! Get up, Drake. Get up, you mong! Go, 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 go! Oh my god, I thought he'd missed it then. Fucking hell. Oh, hello again. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fist fight to the death? Knife fight to the death? That's just not fair. 
Wow, he's cheating. Fuck. Thought I pressed it in time. Oh, no, you don't, dickhead. Although that was quite a neat move, it has to be said. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, not today, sunshine. Off the edge you go. Fuck. Never lucky. Sully, shoot him. Shoot him right in the head. Right in the head. Right in the head, Sully. Right in the head. Right in the face. Right in the... Oh, God damn it. Okay, hello. No! Oh, fuck it out. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck me. Hello, Sully. I'm going to need a hand here. I am going to need... Don't you fucking dare, dickhead. Don't you... No! I really hope that was the final boss fight. I really hope. Because that was infinitely better than either of the two previous games final boss fight. Oh my god, look at this is just fucking sick. Look at the background there, that was amazing. Hello. Please tell me that was the final boss, because that was that was brilliant. That was fantastic. I know it was like essentially just a brute fight, but Compared to the previous final bosses, that was a dream come true. And what a sick section to end on. Especially after such a downer couple of fights. I think I think we might I think that might be the case. <laughs> I think we might have actually got through a final boss fight without wanting to kill ourselves. My god. Yeah, Lowe. Much Boom! Immeasurable wealth, huh? Well, it's not much, is it? It's enough. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the end? Feels like that's gonna be the end. A few more cutscenes. That was so good. Oh my god. Uncharted 2, they did the awful bus boss fight and then a cool running away section. And this game, they were like, what if we just did a really big running section and then put a decent me. boss fight in? You okay? Maybe yeah. that would be good. <laughs> and it was. Yeah, I just got something to need saying, that's all. All right. What is it? Look, I, um... You're a tyrant. I had a lousy father. Lousy childhood. I hit 40, I figured I was never gonna have a son of my own. Hell, I never wanted one. What the hell do I know about raising a kid? <laughs> Aww, you you're that gonna that say... Life. Look, you don't have Aww. to know. Listen, I do. I have made a lot of mistakes, kid. A lot. <laughs> and, uh... Well, I am not a perfect man. You're not proposing, are you, Sally? I mean, I love you, uh, but... Stop. Just stop being a wise-ass for one second. How long have you been carrying that around? Too long. Thought I'd lost it. Here's the thing, kid. We don't get to choose how we start in this life. Real greatness? It's what you do with the hand you dealt. Hey. Hey. 
Hey, go. Going somewhere? My place? Maybe. I'm really sorry about your ring. I've got the one that matters. Right. Say something like that. That's a great line. I've Swap got the one that matters. There. Yeah, there we go. Get out of here, huh? Yeah. My man. <laughs> Come on. We're this way. <laughs> Come on. Trust but me. the plane. <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> Not as nice as the one you two wrecked four years ago, but it'll do. <laughs> Come on. Let's see if I can remember how to fly the goddamn thing. Hey, this has parachutes, right? <laughs> Three. Uh, more or less. Yes! Is that that's gotta be the end, right? That was so good. Oh, thank you. They did, I mean, at that point I knew that that had to be the final boss fight. It's not that we're going to suddenly introduce another thing, but that was so much better. So much better. Holy shit. I got pretty fucked off in the last, like, from the final hour to the final half hour when it was all that crappy uh, hallucination fighting stuff. That really got on my nerves. Like, don't just fucking add bullet sponge enemies to the end of your game to make it artificially harder. Just don't. It's not good. And the fact that it was like just shitloads of it, one after the other. But aside from that, aside from a couple of issues with other bits, like the bit where the plane was falling apart, the, when they just threw a ton of dudes at you and the cover was moving everywhere so you couldn't like hide and so they just destroyed you and stuff. A couple of, a couple of little issues, but for the most part, the only major issue was that end hallucination sequence. And uh, aside from that, this was fucking excellent. Excellente. Easy, easy nine. Easy nine out of ten. Very, very good. I think the best sequence was still the fire sequence, which was pretty near the start, which is a shame. But the others just had a couple of issues, like the, the convoy chase had the RPG bit that fucked me off. The, uh, the water temple thing had a water temple. Like, this is Zelda. Um... <laughs> the watery boat thing had uh I can't remember what it had now it had something that fucked me off what was it who knows like that's how not important it was is that I don't even remember and then they they nailed the ending they really did Ru the runaway section cool as hell I managed it first try thank god because I hate like feel it really takes away from those sections when you have to repeat them doesn't feel as awesome the second time around kind of thing because you're like okay yeah just get through it kind of thing first time it's like you know on the fly you don't know where you're going you don't know what's going to happen kind of thing so it's cooler and then the final fight with Talbot much much better much much better than Lazara bitch or the dude who was so irrelevant until the final wait thanks to Guerrilla Games and Sony Santa Monica and Bungie thanks to Bungie why thanks to Bungie did Bungie help? Did Sony Santa Monica help? Bungie, wasn't Bungie still a Microsoft owned studio at this point? Or not owned? Did, we, did Microsoft own Bungie or were they just working with them? I can't remember. I think they must have just been working with them because Bungie was able to leave, so it can't have been that they owned them. Interesting. Curious why that is. But yeah, overall, top tier. Can we skip these? Anything at the end? There never is, is there? No. Brilliant! Well, there you have it. That is all of the Nathan Drake collection. One, two, and three. They got better each time. Till three was like, very, 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 very good. Very good game. And, uh, that just leaves four and the Lost Legacy. So we will be beginning four tomorrow. Or, you know, <laughs> if you're not watching this live, then it's already up, but yeah. 
Thank you very much for watching. I'm excited to start 4, because if this trend continues, then 4 should be like a 10 out of 10. I'm pretty sure 4 is the only one of... I'm pretty sure 3 was like previous gen as well, right? Whereas 4 launched current gen. So that's going to be really nice to see as well. Something that's actually like kind of up to date. Was Uncharted 4, yeah, it was actually their last game, I think. Oh, well, no, Lost Legacy. Yeah. But like... These are the last two things they've done, have been Uncharted 4 and Lost Legacy, I believe. So, theoretically, this is like pinnacle stuff. So I'm really, I'm really excited for it. I hope it lives up to my own hype that I've sort of created for it in my mind. Anyway, we shall see. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I will see you for Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.